thanks for being here. I'm John Erickson. This is your NBC 26 News Update. And the U.S. Census Bureau has released data for the first time in 10 years. And nothing's changing for the Badger State. Wisconsin's population has grown by 3.6% since the last census 10 years ago in 2010. But we will continue to have eight representatives in the House while our neighbors in Illinois and Michigan are each losing a seat in the House of Representatives. Notably, California is also losing one, while Texas is gaining two in the U.S. House. News now for low-income families with children. The Biden administration has announced they will be using money from the American Rescue Plan to provide food assistance to children over the summer. We know the kids are at the hungriest during the summer, um, and that's usually because school is out. Right. So this has been an extraordinary time for people struggling with food insecurity in the state of Wisconsin. And this program is going to help an awful lot of kids. The USDA estimates it's going to be one hundred and seventy two million dollars directly into the state of Wisconsin for food help. Under the program, each eligible eligible child will receive just under seven dollars each weekday. That's just under four hundred dollars for the summer. Let's turn now to a check of our weather with chief meteorologist Cameron Moreland. Cameron. John, we're going to see some thunderstorms tomorrow created by a warm front that's going to create all different types of weather across northeast Wisconsin and the state of Wisconsin tomorrow. I'm saying a high right around 50 for the Green Bay area, but uh, north of Green Bay, probably 40s for highs and south and west of Fond du Lac, 70s and 80s. On Wednesday and Thursday, the frontal boundary that's going to create the wide range of temperatures tomorrow drops farther south. That means widespread showers in 50s for just about everybody. But look at this. As we head into May, it looks like it's going to warm up nicely with a chance for a few showers and maybe a thunderstorm. Have a great night, everybody.